Very fortunate that you'll see dear Leslie as part of the school faculty, as both counselor and nurse. Yeah. It's nice that I've seen her a lot more than usual. Indeed. Did you know that she's a mother now? Adopted mother, to be precise. To a girl from the East Ends. Leslie had been looking after her since last year, and signed every document and attended every courthouse to become a legal guardian. I believe she is your age, Master Bruce. Younger by only a few months. Wait, what? Leslie's a mother? Yes, sir. I assume Leslie has told her about you. Why would she do that? Because Leslie knows you wouldn't. Perhaps she is hoping that a friendship will strike up between you and her new daughter. I'm afraid. Your days of being homeschooled have made you knowledgeable and intelligent beyond comprehension, no doubt. However, the lack of socialization you've had has concerned me. As your guardian, it pains me to see you reading half your library and mastering chess alone, when you could be... Making friends? Was nothing. Mm. Oh, oh, uh, sorry. Oh, oh, my books. Let me give you a hand there. I'm Bruce. Uh, oh, no, it's okay. Uh, Edward Nigma. Uh, Bruce is such a popular name these days. Do you know 14% of the world is actually called Bruce? You learn something new every day, I suppose. Indeed. Uh, do I know you? I don't think I've seen you in any of my classes before. Uh, yeah. I'm only here for the rest of the school year, though. Well, I'd be happy to give you a tour, uh, if you don't mind. That sounds like a good idea. So, this is, uh, the bathroom where you can, uh, e <laughs> Never mind. It's multi-gender, so... Both genders can use it. Oh. This is the cafeteria where you can socialize and make friends with new people. Well, to you, they're going to be new, but I don't come here very often because uh, I don't have many friends. Hmm. But I'm sure you will. And finally, this is the hallway where you can put your things inside lockers. Uh, but anyway, uh... I, well, uh, where was I going with this? Oh, yeah, this, this is my locker here. You see? Well, I believe you've shown me every inch of this school. Uh, well, it's better to know where you're going than being in an everlasting blur and not knowing where you are at all. Wow, that was pretty cool. Do you do poetry? Yeah, uh, only when I'm bored and stuff. Ah, uh, well, where are your friends? Me? Friends? <laughs> Sorry, uh, but yeah, I don't have many friends. I only have one friend. Oh, who is he? He is a she. Huh. Selena, this is Bruce Wayne. I can see that, Eddie. Thanks. Well, I'll say. What's rich, trust-funded Bruce Wayne doing here among the crazy? My money doesn't make me any different from either of you. Well, I'm sorry, but not all of us get to live up in a big mansion with butlers and bricks of gold. No, but I suppose I can't be too harsh. I'm Selena Kyle. You've probably met Leslie Tompkins. How would you... Like I said, big mansion, butlers, like the one you were talking to in that fancy car. 
You're quite good at not being seen. It comes in handy. Tompkins disapproves of it, though. But I don't listen. I love her, don't get me wrong. But she doesn't truly understand me. How do you know Leslie? Well, it's a long story. One I don't feel like telling to a complete stranger. Uh, guys, I think we should get going. Why? Lessons don't start in another ten minutes. Look who it is. Great. Who is that? Bane. No one really knows his real name. So we just call him Bane. I heard a new kid has arrived. Yeah, and we <laughs> are the welcoming community. Um, hello. <laughs> oh, and look who else is here. <laughs> Bane, let go of him right now. Yeah, let him go. Or what? Yeah, or what? New kid comes into the school for a few minutes and you're already acting like a brute, eh? Mind your own business, little penguin. Mate, what have I told you about calling me that? I don't think you'd like it if my father had a word with you again. <sighs> this isn't over, Enigma. Come on, girl. Who is that? That's Oswald. He's not my friend, but he's not Bane, either. Don't worry, new kid. Those lads give you any more trouble you tell me, eh? Name's Oswald. I'll see you in class. Good day, class. Please take your seats. Today we are going to be learning about reincarnation. Please open your textbooks to page 185. You are to write down as many notes about the topic and how it relates to religion. I will give you all a series of questions at the end of the lesson. Now, the registration. Edward? Here, sir. Selina? Here. Carlos. Bane. It's Bane. Not happening. Quite a boring subject, if you ask me. I don't know much about it. Nor do I. I'm Bruce. Bruce Wayne. Thomas Elliot, though. Most just call me Tommy. You've been long here, Thomas? First year, actually. Happy to hear I'm not the only one. So, what, what did you do? What do you mean? To come here. What did you do? Yeah, I'm also curious to know why you're here. Yeah, what did billionaire rich boy Bruce Wayne do that was so bad that he got sent here? Run out of soap and throw a tantrum? Real nice. I'm a nice dude. No need to be like that. I'm just cautious. Uh, Selena, I'm sure you can give him a chance. I've given too many chances. So, why are you here? Hey, hey, slow down, mates. Give the young lad some breathing space, eh? Class. Uh, don't mind, Selena. She's just a bit weary of you. Mm, why? Well, she has quite a past with people. What do you mean? Uh, look, you seem like a decent guy, so just, I don't know, warm up to her a little bit. She seems to like you a lot. You two dating or something? <laughs> uh, no, no, we're, we're just friends. Uh, well, I better be heading off to next lesson. Um, I'll see you later, Bruce. Looks like our new friend has decided to join us. Seems like it. We should introduce ourselves, since it was cut short last time. Is it really worth it? I mean, he's small, puny, weak. He's just extra weight. Maybe so, but he's Bruce Wayne. <laughs> Are you okay? Uh, what? 
It's just, you look a bit pale. Gee, real nice. No, no, I didn't mean to offend. No problem, it's alright. I, I have this thing? It's an unknown condition. At least that's what my doctor said, anyhow. I'm Bruce. I know, you said that to almost every student here today. <laughs> You're a clowny type, aren't you? I'm more of an introvert than most. I mean, I mean, I can. I'm alright with human interaction. It's just I say the wrong thing sometimes. The uh, what are you doing? Sitting down. Uh, right. Uh, nice to meet you. The feeling's mutual. 